Good evening, teacher. Hello, sir. How are you? Hi. Thank you. Welcome back. A pleasure to Thank see you. you again. Thank you, teacher. Okay, can you hear me very well? Yes. Welcome back to all of you. Good evening. Good evening. Today Good evening. we're going to start a new lesson. I hope that all of you got the material in order that we can study the new topic for today. Any problem to get into the platform or soon? Not the chip. 
Okay. Okay, let me check up the, the attendance first. Ana Cristina? Okay, Ana del Carmen? Ana del Carmen. It's not here. Angel Narciso. Present, teacher. Okay. Cristina Estefani Martinez. Present teacher. Okay, welcome. Fatima. Fatima. It's not here. Giovanni Alexander. Present teacher. Present sir. Harrison Manuel. Present. Okay, welcome. Juan Carlos. Juan Carlos. Juan Carlos. It's not here. Karen Yesenia. Present teacher. Karina. Present. Linda Ivet. Present teacher. Welcome. Okay. Maria Julia. Present. Marlene Nicole. Present. Okay. Nancy. Nancy. Okay. Norma Carolina. Present teacher. Welcome. Thank you. You're welcome. Rafael Ernesto. I'm here, teacher. Okay. Raquel Judith. Present teacher. Welcome. And Suleima Veronica. Suleima, are you there? Suleima, it's not here.
Okay, let us start now. Teacher, good evening, Ana del Carmen. Ana del, Ana del Carmen is coming, okay. Good evening. Ana del Carmen. Okay. Welcome back. In order to start, um, I'm going to show you something. I hope that you can see it in the right way. And you are going to give me a word with the letter that I'm going to show you. For example, if I show you this, I don't know if you are going to be able to see it. Let me see. Okay, I need a volunteer who wants to. Church. Okay, church. Excellent. Uh huh. Let me see what else I have here. What about this one? Nine. Only one, only one, please. Nine. Okay, let me shuffle it. Let me shuffle it. Okay, what about this one? Um, let me see. The one that has the cameras off. Let me see. Uh -huh. Giovanni Alexander. Teacher mm -hmm. A. C. Repeat again. C. Could you spell it, please? I'm sorry? Could you spell it, please? Spell it. Yeah. No? Do you? How do you spell the word? ¿Cómo deletrea la palabra que me está diciendo? La. Y. El, pues es una solo es una letra no, una, no sería una palabra o, you no, are going no, to start a word with this letter correct let's see how do you spell the word eh, si en hay Okay, tell me in Spanish, what is the word? The word, la Z. Yes, but, but that is the letter. Yes. Okay, but the word that you create, where, which one? The word. La palabra que usted creó usando esta letra, ¿cuál fue? Sí. Oh, no sé si era tarea, teacher. Y... <ríe> que yo no estuve ayer. <ríe> ok, ok, ok. Veamos. Esta, esta es la letra. Con esta letra usted debe de crearme una palabra. Por ejemplo, yo digo su. Z o o. Su. Ok. Tiro. Zero, zero, okay. Zero. Salvado por la campana. Okay. <laughs> okay, somebody else? Sam. Sunshine. Ah, oh, sunshine, or oh, sun, okay, excellent. Excellent. Let me see. Um, let 
What about this one? No. No. <laughs> Another one? Kilometers. Kilometer. Okay. Rafael? Keeper. Keep. Keep. Keeper. Ajá, ok. Ahora sí, ya veo que ya los desperté, ya, ya, ya los veo despiertos. Ok, I like that. I got a the bundle of car here in order to, to show you. And also I have more, but today we are going only just to use that. Ok, in order to start today, we, are, we have some questions. Remember that I need that you participate in the question. So please, uh, you are going to give me the answer. This is a class number seven and we are going to study how to use that pair of frequencies. And we have this question. Who wants to read the phone? Who wants to read it? Me. The phone, please. Me, teacher. Okay, tell me. What is some important strategy restaurant could be implement, implement to get more clients? Okay, that is the first one. What is an important strategy restaurants could implement to get more clients? Okay, think about it. And the second say, what are some successful restaurants you know? But let us concentrate on the first one, please. What is an important strategy a restaurant could implement to get more clients? Okay, tell me. Think. And, and, and raise your hand if you want to answer, please. Maybe promotion. Ah, could be promotion. It is like uh, advertisements in different mass medias could be. Is that true, Marlene? Okay, what else? Que mas? Good attention. Ah, good attention. As soon as people are right there, uh, somebody, the waiter had to go and attend and ask, uh, okay, here is the menu. What can I do for you? Are you ready to order? Uh, or maybe, okay, you are going, the one that are going to give me the extra cherries, okay? What else? They give away. Linda. And then okay, they could an announce announce no sé como anunciarse announce maybe marketing no ah marketing in social media media in social media yes social media okay social media okay and the another the other lady. Giveaway in social media. Social media? Yeah. That means that they are going to look for another kind of uh, way to, to announce. That is what you mean? Okay, somebody else want to say something about it? Tell me, please. I'm going to read again the question because maybe you have forgotten. What is an important strategy restaurant could implement to get more clients? And the second one said, what are, what are some successful restaurants you know? 
you can tell me. Okay. Sulema, what can you tell me about it? Mm, sorry, teacher. Okay, Sulema, no problem. Uh, let me si me indica, perdón, si me indica en qué página está, es que no pude revisar la clase de ayer, cómo me conectaba y me desconecté para, para irlo siguiendo. Oh, ok, excelente. Discul disculpe. No problem. Let me see. Let me see. It is number 21. 21. Thank yes. you. Yes. Let star it is there. Okay, let us talk about the second question. What can you tell me? About the second question, please. Maybe you can talk about your favorite restaurant that you visit that you prefer for different situation. Maybe you like the food or maybe um, you enjoy the weather there. Just tell me. La Pampa, teacher. Oh, La Pampa, Argentina. Okay. What can you tell me about La Pampa? Um, Give me some fish about La Pampa, okay. What do you like in the Pampa? Tell me. The, the meat um, is, is, a, is a good. Okay. In, the, in, the, in the dinner, it's a good. Okay, okay. That means that you, you prefer the Pampa and tin. Okay. Somebody else? Tell me. How often do you eat out? Claudia Camila. Hello. Claudia Canela, teacher. Ah, okay. Claudia Canela. Yes. Oh, okay, okay. What can you tell me about the restaurant? Sorry? What can you tell me about Clavo y canela. Ah, okay. Uh, all, of, all of the food, uh, good location, uh, excellent uh, attender. Okay. Only. Okay. Where is it? Um. Just a general address. Ah, okay. Um, uh, in between Avenida Olímpica, Avenida Olímpica, in... Sí, sí, miles, metro C, metro... 67 Avenida Norte. Okay, a general, general. It is close to... Salvador. Yes, yeah, it's San Salvador, but it is close to Metro Centro. Salvador, it's... Metro Centro, Sisi Miles, Santa Elena. Oh, okay, I like that, I like that. Yes, I, I, I like that kind of information. Okay, somebody else. What about you, Harrison? Tony Super... Romas. Uh, Tony Roman, okay. Tony Roman, exquisite. 
Uh, oh my good. <laughs> okay. What about you, Harrison? What can you tell us? Your favorite restaurant? Harrison? Yes, teacher, yes. Uh, I hope you go but uh, when I leave, I go to, to the to the beach. I prefer to go to the beach. Okay, the Soto Beach Hotel. No, no, for example, <laughs> Hola Betos, um, okay. for example. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, no mm -hmm. problem. Okay, somebody else want to talk about your, your different restaurant that you know? No quieren que sepamos cuáles son. Mi teacher. Ah, ok, Zuleima. Eh, en restaurant San Martín. Eh, okay. My mother love the, um, el pan horneado, bread, baked. Ok. Y sucur, ¿cómo se dice la sucursal que le encanta a ella es? Branches. Eh, Thank you. Branch. Escalón. Branch. Yes. Branch. On the, it is Thank only you. One. Branch is Escalón o de la mascota. De la mascota. I like to hear you. I like to hear you, but I would like to hear to all of you participate. Okay, we, we already talked about your favorite restaurant. Let's go to study our material. But we are talking about maybe your favorite, but at the same time, successful restaurant, you know, right? Because um, they have a special characteristic. For the reason you prefer to go there with your family and friends. Okay, now we have a conversation here. You are going to listen to your teacher. I'm going to read it and then we are going to practice. Mr. Mott and Jennifer, they are talking. You can see them in the picture. She's wearing a, uh, a, a purple gloves. And both of them are wearing uh, glasses. Okay, Mr. Mott is start talking. Hello, Jennifer. How is it going? Just fine, Mr. Mo. I am just checking the number of people who come in a regular basis. That sounds good. Look, I am thinking about new marketing strategies and I want to know something. Tell me, sir, how often do we change the menu? Well, we seldom change the menu. However, we are promoting a dessert every week. Do we ever give promotional item? No, sir, we never do. Okay. We have the conversation, they are talking about a restaurant. And they are talking about the menu and if they give promotion item. And that is, that is the conversation. I'm going to read it again. Hello, Jennifer, how is it going? Just fine, Mr. Mo. I am just checking the number of people who come in to a regular basis. That sounds good. Look, I am thinking about the new marketing strategies and I want to know some things. Tell me, sir. How often do we change the menu? Well, we seldom change the menu. However, we are promoting the dessert every week. Do we ever give a promotional item? No, sir, we never do. Okay, and the last time that I'm going to read it, I'm going to do it slowly. Hello, Jennifer, how is it going? Just fine, Mr. Mo. I am just checking the number of people who come in a regular basis. 
That sounds good. Look, I am thinking about new marketing strategies and I want to know some things. Tell me, sir, how often do we change the menu? Well, we still don't change the menu. However, we are promoting a, a dessert every week. Do we ever give a promotional item? No, sir, we never do. Okay, questions? If you have a question, just let me know, please. No. No question, okay, volunteer. I need to volunteer who wants to read it. Only two, please. No more than two. Okay, Anna Cristina. And somebody, somebody else, please. Me. Okay, Cristina Stepan. Okay, last talk, I ask Cristina and Cristina. I like that. Okay, good. Hello, Jennifer. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, okay hold on. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Uh, if you want, you can use your own names. You are going to say, hello, Cristina. How is it going? Okay, go ahead. It's going. Just fine, Cristina. I am just checking the number of people who come in regular basis. Sounds good. Lot. I am thinking about new marketing strategies, and I want to know some time. Tell me, sir, Mister. No. Yeah. How often do we change the, the menu? Well, we seldom change the menu. However, we are promoting uh, the source every week. Do we, do we ever give a promotion item? No, miss, we never do. Okay, thank you. Yeah. Uh, I need that you pay a special attention. For example, to this word, I am just, just, I am just checking the number of people. As you can see, the letter U is like an, like an, 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 an open A, an open A. Is, it is in Spanish like A, you know? Yes. And let me see what is in there. Another one. Okay, right here. Promotional item. Item. Strategies. 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 Okay, say it. Say it. Strategies. Repeat, please. Strategies. Strategies. Listen. Strategies. Listen. Strategies. Listen. It's a letter S at the beginning. Strategies. Strategy. Right. Okay, hold on. Strategies. 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 No with E at the beginning. No le pongan una E, no le pongan una e al, al inicio. No. Strategies. 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 No, 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 no me la confundan con, con cuál es la palabra que me estaba sonando ahí. Como tragedia, ¿no? But don't get confused. Okay, somebody else wants to read it, please. Me, teacher. Okay, tell me. Yo mm. sola. <laughs> Somebody else want to help? Alguien me. Quiere... Okay, Marlin. Yes, Marlin. Okay. Uh, hello, Marlin. How is it going? Just fine. 
Anna. I'm just checking the number of people who come in a regular basis. That sounds good. Look, I am thinking about new marketing strategies in, and I want to know some things. Tell me, miss. How often do we change the menu? Well, we seldom change the menu. However, we are a promoting a dessert every week. Do we ever get a promotional item? No, miss. We never do. We never do. I ten. 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 Remember that this letter was a vowel, and you say I. I ten. This is menu. Menu. Okay, somebody want to do it, please, before to go to the breakout room. I'm going to read again. Hello, Jennifer, how is it going? Just fine, Mr. Mo. I am just checking the number of people who, who come in a regular basis. That sounds good, looks. I am thinking about the new marketing strategies. And I want to know some things. Tell me, sir, how often do we change the menu? Well, we seldom change the menu. However, we are promoting a dessert every week. Do we ever give a promotional item? No, sir, we never do. Ah, okay. I need somebody else who wants to do it, please. Maria, what to go to the breakout room? No, no volunteers who want to do it. Oh, okay. I'm. I do really so. Okay. Okay. Remember that at the moment that you are reading, I can help you because I'm listening to you. Let me see, 16, uh -huh. okay. Let's go to breakout room and try to practice. Use your own names, please. Let's do it. Let's do it now. Ana Cristina and Karen Yesenia.
And right now they are practicing the conversation. And so now we feel in the break up room, they are going to do it in front of the class. Mr. Herson. Hi. Go. Okay. Me first. Yes. Hello, Julie. How is it going? Just fine, Mr. Herson. Mr. Hernandez, excuse me. And I am just checking the number of people who come in on a regular basis. That sounds great. That sounds good. Sorry. Look, I am thinking about new marketing strategies and I want to know some things. Tell me, sir. How often do you change the menu? Well, we seldom change the menu. However, we are promoting a dessert every week. Do we ever get a promotional item? No, sir, we never do. Thanks. Okay, thank you, Zambarillo. Suleyma. Suleyma. Okay. Are you there, Suleyma? Hello, Suleyma. How is it going? You find, Christina, I am just checking the number of people who come in the regular places. That's as good. Look, I am thinking about the about new marketing strategies. I am going to know something. Tell me, sis. How often do you wear change the menu? Well, we seldom change the menu. Uh, over the, we are promoting a dessert every day weekend. weekend. Thank you. Ariel, please. Me, teacher. Nancy. Hey, Raquel. Okay. Hello, Nancy. How's it going? Just fine, Miss Raquel. I am just checking the number of people who come in regular visits. That sounds good. Look, I am thinking about new marketing strategies and I want to know something. Tell me, sir. How often do we change the menu? Well, we seldom change the menu. However, we are promoting a dessert every week. Do we ever give a promotional item? No, sure. We never do. Thanks. Thank you. Okay, thank you. Somebody else, please. You are near ready. Ready, Juan Carlos. Hello, Giovanni. How is how is going? Yes, fine, Mr. Juan Carlos. I am just checking the number of people who come in a regular basis. That's so good. Look, I am thinking about new marketing strategies and I want to know some, some thing. Tell me, Chair. How often do we change the menu? Well, we seldom change the menu. 
However, we are promoting a dessert every week. Do we ever give a, pro, a promotional item? No, sir. We never do. Thank you, Johnny. Welcome. Somebody else, please. Somebody else? No? Somebody else? Okay, let us continue then. Okay, we have some questions that you need to answer it in pairs. You are going to say it in pair. And the question one said, what kind of restaurant do you think Jennifer managed? And the second question, what are some marketing strategies the restaurant is using nowadays to get more clients? Okay, yes. Give me an answer, please. What kind of restaurant do you think Jennifer managed? And the second one, what are some marketing strategies the restaurant is using nowadays to get more clients? Let us discuss this question, please. What can you tell me about it? Tell me. Any idea? Bakery, no. No? About bakery, no. Could be. Maybe. Somebody else? I think uh, what um, king of, of restaurant of, of those who are not interested in business. In business. Okay. What else? I think who care about having extra dairies, but 
more client. Okay. Remember the first question, what kind of restaurant do you think Jennifer managed? And the second one, what are some marketing strategies the restaurant is using nowadays to get more clients? Based on the, on the conversation that we have started. Um. Mr. Mo, uh, he's thinking about new marketing strategies. For the reason he's asking some question to Jennifer. And he asked how often he changed the menu. Did and Jennifer you? said, no, sir, we never do that. We, we never do any promotion and something like that, okay? What, what can you infer about that? Based Teacher, on that. Okay, excuse me, tell me. And number two, maybe okay. pay to for one. Number two? Yes, pay to for one. Um, some marketing strategy to restaurant in actuality. Okay, give me an example. Teacher, pay two for one. O sea, paga dos, llévate uno. Okay, could be. But, but, but remember, uh, sometimes when we talk about, yeah, it is part of marketing also, but we need to go forward. Ana del Carmen? Eh, la promo promoting um, a desserts every week in the restaurant. Eh, esa es la promoción, pues, el, el, el postre, every week, eso es lo que entendí, no sé si estoy mal. Yes, but... Esa es but, una, la estrategia. Yeah, but, but the question, the question now is, the question is, what are some marketing strategies the restaurant is using nowadays to get more clients? But nowadays, and talking about strategies. We when, sell lunch, we, we sell lunch at the menu. However, we are promotion the dessert every week. Okay. When we talk about marketing, we are talking about advertising. You know, in order to promote a restaurant, we can use social media live. Uh, you can use Instagram, you can use uh, Facebook. That is, we are talking about marketing. <clears throat> and at the same time, uh, you can try to implement to what, what Karen said, you can pay one and take an, an extra free. Could be a different option. Okay, what, what, what else you can tell me about it? Imagine that you are the owner of the restaurant and you will need to promote in order to get more clients. Discount when paying with a credit card. Ah, okay. You are going to get a discount if you pay by credit card. 
Ah, we have said Bitcoin too. If you pay with Bitcoin, you are going to get an extra donut and a coffee. Could be in that way too. Okay, what about you, Rafael, Ernesto, Hernandez, Sandoval? Do you want to say something about this? I think two by one. Two by one, two by one. Two by one. Uh -huh. Only in La Neveria. Eh, yeah. Ni ahí ya no hay. Okay, I don't know, but you visit uh, different places and you have to think about how they promote, you know, that you can go in, in, and spend your money there. You need to think about it. Imagine when they talk about Black Week Day, they uh, they tell us that we have a, a, a discount, like a 50% of discount, but in fact, it's not true. It's true. Really? <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe, maybe in my company, yes, it's true. Mm. But no, it's nice. Mucho descuento. Well, more discount. More discount. Discount. Where mm -hmm. in fact, um, I've been starting marketing. Yo no le subo los precios y después le pongo descuento. <laughs> Generalmente hay algunas reglas que aplican los comerciantes y ellos aunque hayan hagan descuentos nunca pierden. All can you, all can, all can you eat, teacher? Oh, can, can you eat in a buffet? Okay, you can pay like a twenty-five dollar. You are going to eat a lot, but I have no a, But I have a problem. Uh, I remember as soon as I came back to El Salvador, I saw an uh, an ad, be un anuncio. Uh, about a buffet, be un anuncio de un buffet, like you are saying, all you can eat. And when I, uh, when I ask to the workers and I say, okay, uh, how much is it? How much I have to pay? And she told me the amount of money. And I asked, okay, but I'm going to have the opportunity to uh, take all the food that I want, all the time that I want. And she said, no. You are going to choose all the food, but only only once. And I said, no, 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 no. I don't like it in that way. Because uh, in the United States, I pay like $25 and I can stay there like two hours eating different kind of food, but not to go, only just to eat there in the place. But maybe it's some, some, something is happening in some areas in El Salvador. They got some mm -hmm. ideas, but they are not respecting the rules. Yes. And talking about discount, well, I know a little bit about that, you know? But sometimes it's really difficult to, to get it uh, a discount, a 50% off. If you are, uh, if you have time, Cuando tengan tiempo, consulten los precios antes de Black Weekend y luego vayan a ver y se van a dar cuenta que son los mismos algunas veces. Mala, pro <laughs> mala propaganda. Ok, let us continue talking about. But in your company, Marlene, that is true, right? Yes. Ok. Bueno, siempre deben de haber algunas que sí cumplen. Pero las más grandes... Sí, pero no todas. Es cierto. <risa> es cierto. Ah. ¿Y se recuerdan cuando comenzó eso del Black Weekend aquí en El Salvador? Hasta más gente? caro, hasta más caro, ¿sabes? A lot of people dijo. making lines in Walmart, you know. Yes. En la Curazao. Ya, viven en la Curazao. 
That usually happen, uh, that kind of discount usually happen in, in another countries like United States, but there are a lot of reasons why they do that there. But now Pero ahora ya no tiene sentido, teacher. Hola. Lo hace, ya no tiene sentido. Y desde agosto empiezan con eso de Black Friday. <laughs> Sé lo, que, sé lo que le estaba explicando que en Estados Unidos uh -huh. sí he visto eso porque eh, los fabricantes directos son los que ponen esos precios en cambio aquí no hay sí, allá sí vale la pena. aquí no hay eh, eh, aquí solamente hay revendedores uh -huh. ellos le van ganando el 200% entonces hasta más pero no, no, no le hagamos la mala propaganda. Mejor <risa> ¿Sí? Pero you can go to buy in, in, in Black Weekend, ¿ok? Black Friday, they call. Ok, that, but that, that is a, a strategy that they use in order to sell something. Ok, let me see. Veamos la asistencia, por favor. Ana Cristina. Ana Cristina. Hello. Say hello, say hello, please. Say hello, wake up, wake up. Ana del Carmen. Present teacher. Ok. Ángel Narciso. Present teacher. Ahora ha venido Shai, don Ángel no ha hablado. <laughs> What's going on, sir? Present teacher. Okay. Christina Stephanie. Present teacher. Fatima. Present. Eh, Giovanni. Present teacher. Harrison. Present. Juan Carlos. Present teacher. Karen? Present. Karina? Present. Linda? Present, teacher. Maria? Maria Julia? Present. Okay. Arlen. Present. Nancy, Yvette. Present teacher. Norma. Present teacher. Rafael Ernesto. Present teacher. Raquel Judith. Present teacher. And Veronica Suleima. Present teacher. Oh, Suleima Melgar. Okay, thank you. Let us continue talking about this topic. Okay, we already talked about these questions and you already answered it, okay? And talking about the number one, what kind of restaurant do you think Jennifer managed? Maybe traditional. It's no update, up to date. No se ha modernizado todavía, por eso no ha comenzado con las promociones. But you have some ideas how to deal with this, okay? Okay, let us talk about how uh, to use odd bear of frequency. Odd bear of frequency indicate how often an action takes play. Somebody want to read it, please? <clears throat> No? 
Anybody? Oh, okay, I'm going to read it. Always, seldom, oh. readily, sometimes, hardly ever, and never. And we have an example. We often change the menu. We always give away promotional item. They regularly select the new options. Okay. I need that you identify the, the adverb in the sentences. If you can see, uh, as soon as after the personal pronoun, we are going to use it. It is in the middle of the personal pronoun and the main verb. We always give, they regularly select. But do you remember that they have a, a percentage? Se recuerda que tienen porcentaje los, los adverbios de frecuencia. Somebody yes. remember? Yes. Do you remember it? Está with 0%? Zero. Which one is the one that has a zero percent? Never. Never. Okay. <laughs> Give me an example, please. I never go to sleep. I never go to sleep before to take a shower. Okay, tell me. Okay, let us see, let us see what we have here, okay. Uh, at very frequency, and we have the example, we have a 0% never, 5% hardly ever or gradually, 10% is seldom, 30% occasionally, 50% is sometimes, 70% often or frequently, 80% normally, generally, 90% usually and 100% always. Okay, Marlene, read the number one, please. Wake up, wake up, wake up. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I'm just kidding, uh, I'm just kidding. 100% always, I always study after class. Okay, uh, create your own sentence using always, please. Uh, I always drive to my work. Uh, you always drive to your work. Okay, thank you. Tell me another name. Uh, Rafael. Go okay, ahead, Rafa. Rafa. The 9100, usually, I usually watch your work. Okay, and you're on center? Repeat, please, teach. Your own sentence. Your own. Create your own sentence. I don't understand. Que cree su propia oración usando usually. Uh, okay. I usually uh, do exercises. Okay, okay. Push up, jumping job. Okay. Uh, give me a number, please. No, 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 a name, a name, I'm sorry. Give me a name. Mr. Narciso. Okay. Mr. Cardona is the one. Thank you, Rafael. 90% uh, 
uh, normally, generally, I normally get good marks. Okay, what about the percent? 90. This one? This? Eight. 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 Do exercise. I normally do exercises. Okay. Give me a name, please. Give me a name. Karen. Karen. Um. Often, frequently, I often read in bed at night. Okay, don't don't forget this. And 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 for a season two, don't forget when we have a, a letter at the end, normally, generally, in this case, it is frequently. Fre frequently. Frequently. Yes. And right here, okay. I often, uh, or sometimes you can hear it, I often, some people say in that way. I often read in bed at night. Okay. Often, frequently, I often read in bed at night. Okay. Okay. Uh, you need to, uh, let, how can I explain you this? You need to know that sometimes this letter sound like in Spanish, like A, sometimes. Algunas veces suena como una E, pero en otras no. Entonces tenemos que tener cuidado porque en español solamente tenemos cinco sonidos de las cinco vocales. Pero en inglés, we can have a different number. All depend on the situation. Ok, give me a, a, a name, please. Chuleima. Um, Uh, okay, so the last one. I always check my email. No, I no, no, use. No, no. Okay, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay. The next one is this. This. No, no, I don't know if you see my mouse pointer. No, ven mi puntero mouse, okay. no. No se observa. Yes. Okay. Oh. ¿Cuál es el que corre el que sigue? We already talked ah, okay. about. Ah, okay, okay. Es que yo había hecho unos e ejemplos. Entonces sigue. Son okay. I sometimes sing in the shower. Okay, listen. Repeat again. Read again, please. Eight. Read, read the sentence again, please. Uh -huh. Eight. Some, sometimes. Sing in the shower. Okay. I sometimes. I sometimes. With a S at the end. I sometimes. And sometimes. Sing in the shower. Sing in the shower. Sing in the shower. Okay. In your okay. own sentence, using some time. Um, Giovanni Pineda. Okay. Uh, it, three, two. Me cuesta pronunciar el número. Thirty percent. Occasionally, I occasionally go to bed late. Thirty percent occasionally, I occasionally go to bed late. Okay, give me your own sentence. I occasionally drink soda. 
Okay. Okay. Give me a name. Mm -hmm. Karina. Karina. Um, ten percent. Seldom. I seldom put salt on my food. Thank you, Rosante. I seldom eat vegetable. Okay, only meat, only meat. Really? Okay, give me a name, please. Julia. Da Gomez. Hello, teacher. Por cual van, perdón. Mm, five. Sometimes. No, number five. Five percent. Perdón, teacher, ¿cuál? Cinco por ciento. Ah, hardly ever. Um, yes. I hardly ever. Um, I hardly ever. Uh, eat at the office. Okay. Give me the last name, please. Sulaim. No había participado ya Sulaim. Yes. Herson teacher. Herson teacher. Ah, Herson. Okay, Herson. Okay, zero. I need that all of you. Zero. Zero. Percent. Okay, zero percent. Continue. Never. Uh, vegetarians never eat meat. Yeah, that is true because I am a vegetarian. And the example, I never stay late at work. Okay. Okay, remember we have the structure subject plus adverb plus the main verb. Example Daniel always passes his exams. And also subject plus B plus adverb. He is always happy. We need to be careful about this. Tenemos que estar cuidadosos eh, aquí cuando tenemos, por ejemplo, el sujeto y tenemos una forma del B, que no va a ser igual que este, que aquí solo tengo el sujeto. Voy a tener el adverbio y luego voy a tener el verbo principal. Se comprende esa parte, ¿cierto? Yes? Yes. Really? Yes. Make a screenshot because you are, maybe you are going to need it. No. In, in the future. Okay, number five, say, write sentences about activities you do at your workplace and use the following adverb of frequency to state how often do you do those activities. We are talking about always, rarely, hardly ever, seldom, sometimes, and never. Teacher, excuse Hello? me. Seldom, ¿qué significa? Ah, it's a good question. But first of all, let me go here. It is a 10%. It is a 10%. Eso es como que... Uh, raro could be in that way seldom es que yo creí que rarely pensé yeah. que era raro mm -hmm. seldom yeah, igual yeah, yeah it, 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 it is uh, almost the same the rara vez con poca frecuencia Okay, thank you. Okay. Okay, let us try to do your own sentences, please. 
work on it, work on it. You don't need to write down everything. If you have it in, if you can tell me, just start to do it with now, if you want. Okay, you can you can uh, try to do it just uh, in mind. Alguien puede ya tratar de hacer las oraciones sin escribirlas. Because at the moment that we are speaking English, we don't need to write down everything. But in Teacher, this case, hello. Eh, please, eh, puede compartir las preguntas que no no le tome captura. Ah, okay, excellent. Thank Here you. We go. Here we go. Okay. Thank you. Okay, you're welcome. Valiente que me la diga sin escribirlas, déme sí. If you know the structure, it's going to be easy for you. Si, si ya se sabe la estructura de cómo va, no le va a costar hacerlo. And at the moment that you are going to speak with somebody else and you want to use a better frequency, you need to keep in mind the structures. Who wants to tell me? Who wants to tell me? Remember, remember, sorry, the, the, the sentence that you are going to create about activities that, that you do at your workplace. 
and you are going to say, I always, I seldom, I rarely, I hardly ever, I sometimes, I never. Because you are going to talk about you. And don't confuse with uh, the translation of the word rarely. Remember that it's uh, N with Y. Cuando las palabras terminan en Y, terminan en la terminación en español de mente, raramente. Sí. Or also, rarely could mean alguna que otra vez. Alguna que otra vez. Or could be con poca frecuencia, contadas veces, pocas veces. Ahí tienen todos los sinónimos de esa palabra. Okay, time is over, time is over. Tell me, tell me, please, what do you have? Thank you, sir. Okay, Fatima is ready, I guess. Fatima? Mm -hmm. I always go to the church on weekend. Okay. I seldom watch television at night. I rarely eat meat. I sometimes go to visit my best friend. I hardly ever go to cinema at weekend. Okay. I never put sugar on the coffee. Okay. Excellent. Thank you. You're welcome. As you can see, it's very easy to use it. Okay, somebody else, please, somebody else. Ana Cristina. Sí. I always go to work at a.m. I rarely my life to go to the movies. I seldom work on Saturdays. Okay. Go to church. Yes. Does it? Hi, teacher. 
Okay, Cristina, Stephanie. I, I always receive the report in the morning. I Patty seldom arrive late in the office. And I rarely arrive late. Sometimes they saw sometimes some they sometimes meet to plan. Hardly ever receive the client in the office of production. Only that is. Repeat the last one, please. Uh, her, uh, I hardly ever receive the client in the office of production. Uh -huh, okay. Okay. I didn't hear the word I. Yeah. <laughs> that, is, that is the reason why I ask you to read it again. Remember that every time we need to put the, the subjects. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. I, Somebody else. I open. sleep, teacher. You are sleepy? Yeah. yeah. Okay. You need to stretch, you know, if you feel that way. Sometimes it's really difficult to control, but we need to look for, try to breathe deeper in and out. Okay, somebody else? Alguien más? Me, teacher. Okay. Okay, and number one, I always do the report on Tuesday. I rarely ever work Sunday. I hardly ever play with Matias. I seldom watching TV at night. So I stay lot in the in the Tania for el nombre. Y I never take other people's money. Thank mm -hmm. you. Somebody Thank else? you. Somebody else? The next, you must, can must. Me, teacher. Okay, Karen. I always take orders daily. I seldom eat in cafeteria of my company. My co-workers and I um, really all have lunch at the same time. We repeat repeat that sentence. I'm sorry. Repeat that sentence, please. Repeat the okay. oración, por favor. Uh, my co-worker and me really all have lunch at the same time. Mm -hmm. What happened there? <laughs> ¿Qué pasa en esa oración? Veamos. Somebody want to help? Um, my co-workers, uh -huh. what do you have after co-worker? Sorry? Excuse me? No listen to chair. Después de la palabra co-worker, ¿cuál tiene? In. A N D. En. Ah, uh, my coworker. En. Mi, yo. En, en mi, okay. Ah. Uh -huh. Rally or have lunch at the same time. O sea, no todos tomamos el almuerzo al mismo tiempo. Rarely. Rarely. Or have. Uh -huh. Rarely lunch. have a lunch at the same time. Okay. At the same time, okay. Okay. Lo que está diciendo es que, que, no que todos tomamos el, 
el almuerzo al mismo, al mismo momento ah, okay. o al mismo tiempo. Okay. No at, this, at the same time. Sí. Sí. Ahí hay que tener cuidadito con eso. Ok. Ok. Thank you. Somebody of this. Hello. Somebody else wants to do it. No. Oh, ok. No, anybody? Mi teacher. Rafael Ernesto. I always do exercise every day. Okay. I seldom arrive late at work. I really read history books. I sometimes watch action movie. Hardly ever, I hardly ever drink beer in the party. I never dance in the party. <laughs> Only watch. Uh -huh. Say the truth, say the truth. Yes, it's true. Tell us the truth. <laughs> sí, no la verdad. Yeah. Ah, okay, okay. I always <laughs> beer. I always beer. Drink beer. Always he drink beer. <laughs> I, always... I know, we know. Ah, uh, you oh. know. Uh -huh. Maybe you are a co worker, right? <laughs> no, no, teacher. Because uh -huh. he he always talks in uh, the class <laughs> ah. <laughs> about this. <laughs> ah, okay, okay, okay. Thank you, Rafael. Thank you. Okay, uh, let me see, because of the time, we need to go ahead with the next slides. Okay, thank you. We are going to continue because of the time. I hope that all of you finish creating your own sentences. And right here, uh, I need that you take a look at the, the graph. Look at the graph showing how often three branches of a restaurant do promotional activities during a month. Then ask a classmate how often each branch does promotion, promotional activities. Write your classmate answer in the chart below. Okay, let, let us take a, take a look at this uh, graph that we have here. For example, this is October. And the third one change the menu. The second one rotate shift. And the third one have a new dessert. And the last one have a promotional item. And we have it in different places like in San Salvador, La Paz, La Union, and Uzulutan. Okay, I need that you uh, take a look of it and tell me how often they uh, make promotion. What do you think about this? And remember that we are talking about three branches. In San Salvador, the eh, sales was hinger. Higher, higher. Yes, in San Salvador. In San promotion. Okay. What happened in La Paz?
la paz to new diesel five promotional item. What about La Unión? Six new diesel night promotion item. And the last one, Uzulutan. Eleven new diesel. Okay. 30, Thirteen promotion item. Okay, okay. Okay, now let me see. Let me see what else do, what you are going to do. Okay, I'm going to give you enough time. And now you are going to uh, create a paragraph using most of the frequency advert that we have studied, talking about yourself. What you are going to do, okay. What you are going to do is just to uh, remember that you already wrote sentences and now what I want uh, is that you create a paragraph. That means that you are going to put together all the sentences, but in a logical order, okay? And try to use all the frequent adverbs. Take your time to do this. Okay, ya escribieron oraciones. Ahora lo que necesito que van a hacer es un párrafo donde utilicen todos los adverbios de frecuencia que hemos visto referentes a usted mismo o misma. You can start now. And then as soon as you have it, you are going to read it. Yeah, remember that today I need to talk with Raquel. You did at the, at the end of the class. You are going to have 10 minutes to ask questions and clarify your dose. For tomorrow, we are going to have 
Λέμεζή, Χριστίνα Στέφανη. Hello, teacher. And for the next one, the very third day is going to be Anna, and the Friday is going to be Karina and me. As soon as you finish, just let me know, please. Remember that it's mandatory that you turn on your cameras. Because when uh, in Sapor audita los, uh, las clases, ellos le gusta ver las cámaras encendidas. Así es que, por favor. I know that sometimes it's difficult, but... If you don't have any problem, just do it. Okay, two minutes left. No quedan dos minutos. Okay, time is over. Thank you. I need uh, all of you to on your cameras and okay, who want to start with talking, reading, whatever. Hey teacher. Okay, Giovanni Alexander. Tell me, Giovanni. Okay. I always drink coffee, but rarely drink chocolate. I like China food, although I hardly ever eat it. Eat, eat, eat. I seldom do exercise, but I sometimes do it. Okay. Me, teacher. 
I like it because you use some connectors or okay, Linda, you bet. Mm. Okay. I always prepare the breakfast and rarely eat eggs. Hardly ever add onions on the food. And sometimes I drink two cups of coffee, but I never go out without empty stomach. <laughs> I like that. I like that. Okay. Excellent. Somebody else, please. Hello. Only Me, teacher. Ah, Me, teacher. Me, teacher. I always get up early to go to to go to work. Rarely do I sleep late on weekends. Sometimes cook the dinner. I hardly ever do the exercise. I never drink the alcohol. Okay, thank you. Somebody else, please. Somebody else, please. Next. I can hear you, I can hear you. I don't know if somebody's trying to say something. Next list. Hello. Hey, teacher. Okay, Harrison. I always get up at 4 a.m. up with this. I sometimes, I sometimes watch, watch TV on weekends. Yeah, I still don't have lunch at 11.30. Uh, I hardly ever late for, for the work. I, I never miss a meeting at work. Okay. Okay, excellent. Somebody else, please, somebody else. Who's next? Who's next? Okay, thank you very much. If you don't want to continue talking, well, let us do something else. Hold on, hold on a second. Okay, uh, one on a time, I'm going to answer it. This exercise, only one, please, only one. No more than one. Okay, who wants to, to answer this one? De los que no han participado, por favor. Which word are you going to use? Rattle. Usually. Okay, I need that you read the, the whole sentence, please. Including the missing word. Usually have breakfast together. No, 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 no. You are going to read. Hey. Day. Yeah, day, and you are going to ask the word that you consider that is the one that is going to pick up. 
They really have breakfast together. Read again, please. No, usually. They no. usually have breakfast to together. together. Mm. They rarely have breakfast together. Okay, let me see who got the bingo. Uh -huh. Rarely. Rarely. They rarely have breakfast together. Okay, what about this one? It always takes a shower twice a day. Okay. Let me see. He always takes a shower twice a day. So, okay, thank you. This one? Chris. <laughs> Chris never brushes her teeth after 18. Chris never brushes her teeth after eating. And the last one is this. Okay, this is the last one. Joshua usually cleans my house. Clean my house. Repeat again, please. Joshua frequently cleans my house. Frequently, frequently, frequently. Okay, that's all for today. Let me check up the, uh, the assistance, please. La asistencia, Cristina. No, Present. Let me see. No, 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 hold on, okay. Ana Cristina Chavarria. Present. Okay, okay, Ana del Carmen. Present. Um, Angel. Present, teacher. Cristina. Present, teacher. Fatima. Present. Fatima, I don't see you. Oh, I got you. Fatima. Uh, Giovanni. Present, teacher. Thank you, sir. Herson. Present. Juan Carlos. Present, teacher. Okay. Uh, Karen Yesenia. Present. Karina Noemi. Present. Linda Ivet. Present, teacher. Eh, María Julia. Present. Marlene. Present. Nancy Ivette. Present, teacher. Nancy Ivette. Norma Carolina. Present, teacher. Rafael Ernesto. Present, teacher. Raquel Judith. Present, teacher. Suleima. Present, teacher. Okay, congratulations, because today, everybody <coughs> is absent. Felicitaciones, hoy están todos. And I hope to see you. To all of you in the next classes. And remember, I, I, I need that you participate. Practice over and over, over and over. Okay, thank you very much. I hope to see you tomorrow. I need to talk with, uh, let me see. A quien le corresponde clase hoy? Dijimos que a. Ya se me hizo, mire. ¿A quién dijimos? A Raquel Judith Vázquez. Raquel, are you there, Raquel? Hola, teacher. Are you going to stay at the end of the class, 10 minutes? Teacher, no voy a poder, fíjese que tengo al niño algo enfermo. 
Okay. Okay, we can switch. Podemos hacer un cambio con alguien. Okay. A volunteer who wants to stay with me at the end of the class. A volunteer, somebody wants to do it. No hay voluntarios. <laughs> no hay voluntarios. Me, teacher. Ah, okay, Cristina. Thank you very much. I do really appreciate your disposition. Okay, good night. Bye-bye. See you tomorrow. Take care. Good I night, hope that, night, teacher. I hope good that night. you bye -bye. work on the platform. Bye-bye. See you, Angel. Good night. Good night, teacher. Good night, good night. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow, sir. Okay, Nancy is there. Hello, Nancy. Nancy. Ah, okay, here we go. Era Don Narciso. <laughs> Don Narciso, no sé qué le pasaba hoy, lo sentí así como... Calladito estaba. Sí, sí, va bastante callado y raro. Él siempre sí. participa. Pero sí. cuando le hice, le pregunté que si se sentía bien, no me dijo. No algo. dijo nada. No, no dijo nada, pero si sí algo le pasa. Ajá, quizás tenía algo. Anda cansado, quizás le tocó muy duro. Quizás Porque... a veces así pasa. Sí, that usually happens to me. You know, sometimes I have to work a lot, a lot of papers to do. Pero, ¿qué vamos a hacer? Así nos toca hacer un montón de cosas. Todo lo bueno cuesta. Dígame qué. Es muy útil. Ok. Uh, I don't know if you have uh, any question about the topic that we have started. Yeah. Ok. Eh, the topic de how you time expression. Ok. Um, how to use time expression? A mí no me quedó muy claro. Okay. Es de cuando utilizar from them until. Eso casi no lo entendí. Okay. When we talk about time expression, cuando nosotros hablamos de expresiones de tiempo, we talk about for, que fue el primero que vimos. Uh -huh. For, we are going to use it for a period of time. El for lo vamos a usar por periodos de tiempo. Por ejemplo, usted puede decir, I work in my job for eight hours. Uh -huh. Podría ser un ejemplo así. O usted dice, I, I work, I work in the, another company for 10 years. Le está dando un periodo de tiempo. Uh -huh. Or uh, you can say, for example, in my case, I can say, okay, I stay in the United States for 10 years. ¿Me comprende uh -huh. bien? Sí, sí. For uh -huh. es, 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 digamos, por, por si entendí, va, for... I work for uh, eight hours. Or okay. I receive the 
class English for two hours. Two hours, okay. You are talking about periods of time. Mm -hmm. Hablando de periodo de tiempo. Mm -hmm. Send sería el, el, la, la distancia del tiempo, algo así. Since. For since. 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 Uh -huh. since. Things. 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 When we use things, we are uh, talking about a specific point in the past. Estamos uh, hablando de un punto específico en el pasado. ¿Sí? Uh, com, como cuando se dice eh, para las empresas grandes, ¿va? Traba, eh, eh, trabajamos o somos desde, desde el año 1980. Ok, since 1980. Uh, I work since 1980. Sí, ahí está usted eh, especificando un punto en el tiempo. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Por ejemplo, yo podría decir, since I left my parent house, de que yo dejé la casa de mis padres. Ajá, ¿Qué es lo que ha pasado ahí? Ahí estoy poniendo uh -huh. un punto en el tiempo. Uh -huh. ¿Sí? O usted dice, since I got married, desde que yo me casé, dice, y usted comienza a decir qué es lo que pasó. O puede decir, since I bought my... I don't marry a teacher. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't really sorry. <laughs> oh, lo siento mucho. Perdón. Pero el ejemplo sería así. Yeah, yeah. I understand. <laughs> and also, you can say, for example, since I bought my own car, desde que yo compré mi propio carro, está poniendo un punto en el tiempo. ¿Sí? ¿Se comprende? Always in the... Yeah. Repeat again. Can you repeat again, please? I, 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 I can hear you very well. Hola. Hello. Hola. Repeat, repeat again. Always in the past. Yeah, talking uh, uh, the, in the past, yes. When okay. you are you're going to use since, that means that you are talking in the past, in uh -huh. a specific point in the past. If, if from is okay. two years or two date. Uh, when we use from, we state the start and the end of time. Cuando usamos from, estamos como demostrando cuando comenzó y terminó algo. Uh, ¿Sí? and the start and, and end. The start and the end. For example, you say, I work from Monday to Friday. From 7 to 8 p.m. Yo trabajo, dice usted, de las 7, que sería el inicio, a las uh -huh. 4 de la tarde, que sería el final. Entonces, ahí vamos uh -huh. a usar from. Uh, I work um, from from I I work in uh, seven I am from four p.m. No, but in this case, I work. I work from seven a.m. to four p.m. Okay. Hello. Hello. 
Hello, hello, hello. Sometimes it's difficult to hear you. I don't know. Maybe your connection or my connection is not working the right way. Alguna de las dos conexiones está como fallándonos. Se le estoy oyendo entrecortado. Hoy, hoy me escucha. Ahorita sí le estoy oyendo bien. Ok. Ok, and the next one, then. And, and from, uh, for example, I work in uh, 7 a.m. from 30 p.m. No, I, para que le suene mejor tendría que ser I work from 7 a.m. for p.m. For p.m. Um, Ese sería el orden. Uh, I work from. I eh, work yo, from. Yo trabajo de las siete hasta tales horas. Uh -huh. Okay. Okay. Yeah. What about the next one? Then. We are okay. using, we are going to use then to introduce a new event. In a series of events. For example, you say, uh, let me see. I, I work from 7 4 p.m. Then I had to go to the supermarket. I use some of the palabra then, que no sirve para. Eh, para introducir un nuevo evento en una serie de cosas como, que... como quien dice luego ah ok sí uh, sí luego uh, it is like uh, when you go to when you take your shower you say I take a shower and then I dry myself with a towel uh -huh. ok uh, oh Make the dinner, then go to the work. Oh, could be. Could be. Okay. And the last one? Until. Yes, until. Until. Uh, yeah, we use it to mark the end of an activity, a period of time. Okay. Vamos a usar para marcar un final, un periodo de tiempo. Como quien dice, eh, until I finish my my duties, until I finish my duties, I had the chance to go to the park. Hasta que terminé mis oficios, tuve chance de irme para el parque. Uh, until is hasta. Ah, hasta. Okay. I understand. Okay, okay. Yeah. Uh, for example, uh, I, uh, I, uh, I work. Uh, in my I office, work, you can say, in my I, office, I, I work in my office until, until finish my report. Hasta que termine el trabajo en la oficina, envío el report. Yo trabajé en mi oficina hasta que termine el report. El report. Yes. I, uh -huh. Pues sí, ya, ya. Oh, es, okay. esa, esa más que todo, esa era la que me, me, me confundía un poco. Ok, ok. Mm -hmm. Ok, thank you very much to stay with me today. Thank you, teacher. Eh, I'm going to make the switch. Voy a hacer el cambio porque como ya usted usó su, su espacio, pero mm -hmm. si en el momento que le corresponda eh, la, la persona que le correspondía no quiere, pues si usted necesita otra explicación. Estamos. Okay. Okay.
Thank, thank, thank you very much. Good night. I hope to see you tomorrow. Good night, teacher. Okay, see you good tomorrow. Bye-bye.